How to balance the combustion reaction of benzene C6H6 plus oxygen that produces CO2 carbon dioxide plus water. In the left hand side we have 6 carbon, then 6 hydrogen, then 2 oxygen. In the right hand side we have 1 carbon, 2 oxygen, 2 hydrogen and here we have more oxygen. Totally we have 3 oxygen. Now Balancing this reaction means you, we need to balance carbon, hydrogen, oxygen from both sides. Balance carbon. Here 6, here 1. So to balance carbon, multiply here by 6. That gives you 6. If you multiply by something, that something must come before the atom. This carbon has come from here. So you have to place 6 as a coefficient. 6 carbon, then 6 times 2, 12 oxygen. So update your oxygen. 12 plus 113. Ox carbon is balanced. Now balance hydrogen here 6, here 2. To balance hydrogen, you need to multiply here by 3. That gives you 6. If you multiply by something, that something must come before the atom. So this hydrogen has come from here. So you have to place here 3 as a coefficient. 3 times 2, 6 hydrogen. Then here we have 3 oxygen. 3 times 12, that gives you 15. Now, balance oxygen here 2, here 15. How can you balance? The only way you need to multiply these two by fraction. Otherwise, you will not get any multiplier that gives you 15. So, look, consider this number as a numerator and this oxygen means this substitute as the denominator. So, you are two to cancel each other so we are getting 15 so that is we need to multiply oxygen by 15 over 2 so here you need to multiply oxygen by 15 over 2 so this oxygen has come from here so you have to write 15 over 2 so this is the balanced reaction 6 6 6 6 15 15 but this is a fraction to omit this fraction you need to multiply whole equation by 2 that gives you two this then if you multiply this by two you'll get 15 then if you multiply this by two you'll get six times to 12 and if you multiply this by two you'll get three times to six all things all things are balanced now so this is the balanced chemical equation